ever built an epic skylight entrance and wondered, is there a better way to go up? I think we all have. <laughs> Hey everyone, it's your friend Think Noodles, and welcome to my survival let's play. And well, a couple of updates. Um, I'm smelting some stuff here. I've come back and I did some mining uh, down in my branch mine. I did not really mining for ore. I was just going crazy through the cobblestone because I need more of it for the nether. And that's what this update's a little bit about. Um, you guys recommended that I use the the dimension, the nether dimension from my old save file that wasn't corrupted with this corrupted storage room. Uh, so I wouldn't have to reslab the areas that I had uh, missed. And you guys are right. I used the dim minus one folder and put it into my save game and it worked. Uh, the nether or all the stuff that I had done in the nether was restored and this was still here in the current save file. So that was a really good suggestion, guys. Thank you for that. Although it's a bit cheaty uh, because... Um, the resources that I took from here in the overworld for the stone, uh, they're back because I restored to um, a save file that uh, in, in the overworld. Uh, so I sort of technically generated stuff that isn't there, but it's okay because I still took the time to mine it. And I guess it saved me a pick too, probably. But anyway, uh, I am here and I've got some XP and I thought, okay, let's uh, let's go ahead and try for this looting sword because uh, we're starting to get pretty far into our, um, what am I doing here? Oh, right, Chani room. Um, we're starting to get pretty far into the Wither Skeleton Farm where it's actually starting to be, ah! Goodness, okay, we're never gonna get a looting three sword, uh, but we do need one. Uh, eventually we will, but I don't have the levels for it now, so we'll just go and stick that in here. And uh, so uh, the other thing is um, I've gone back and forth a couple of times and I have gotten so tired of this. Um, where you go up that and then you go up this and you have to ugh, you have to get it just right. And there we go, and we ride it up to the top. Although it's not just right, I'm sort of drowning. There we go. Ah, uh, whatever. Anyway, uh, you guys know what I'm talking about, and that happens. So this is frustrating as anything. So I had this idea um, uh, to, and I hope that we have the space, or I hope it's not too high. Um, I think, I don't think it is. I think it's about 30 blocks, so it should be just right. If not, we can, uh, we'll figure it out. But yeah, I think that you can throw an ender pearl. I think, 31 blocks, I think it is, or 32. And uh, I think it's 32, but you need it to hit the 31st. So what I'm going to do, guys, hopefully, is create an Ender Pearl elevator. And uh, I'm going to create it right here, in fact. Um, we're going to use the bridge. And what we would do is, um, well, this is pretty much already done. This is crazy. Uh, well, we'd have to take out the center here. So we would take that out, take that out. Oh, I missed one piece. And... Got that piece, all right. So we would take this out and we're gonna put pistons here, uh, sticky pistons, and they'll push the center toward us. And all we need to do, it might look, it's gonna it's gonna clutter up the bridge a little bit, but I don't think it'll be that bad. And uh, it, it's a really simple design. Uh, there, there are much more complicated versions with trap doors and all that stuff, but I'm just gonna use sticky pistons. And the reason I'm up here is because my slime balls are up here. I uh, might as well bring those down. I have pistons downstairs. Do I have tripwire hooks down there? I don't know, just in case we don't have pistons. And uh, this one's not even going to use any redstone dust. It is very, very simplistic. Um, and uh, there we go. And it should work. Um, and um, if my, <laughs> my understanding of, um, of redstone is correct, uh, there shouldn't be any delay. So oh, I can turn that off. Um, there shouldn't be any delay, so we should be able to run across the bridge and not fall through. Although, where am I? Oh, ugh, not this again. There. <laughs> I was disoriented and I got scared again. That's crazy. That thing, that thing really, really messed me up, guys. <laughs> okay, I got that little piece there and uh, ah, tripwire. Yep. And we have enough pistons already, so let's go ahead and do this and put this in here. And we'll make ourselves, ah, might as well make them all sticky. There. Uh, but we're only going to need four, so let's, um, I'll put that in there, and we'll put two there. Uh, we got that, we got the trip bar. Oh, we need string. I have no idea where string is these days. 
Uh, I think it might be upstairs. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's upstairs, Bones. Yep. All right, let's uh, let's go ride our. <laughs> well, see, and, and there is like you can do this, um, which I've done a few times. But it do it it's not as efficient as an Ender Pearl elevator. Oh my gosh! See, this is the part that's annoying. There we go. So, ugh. See, um. So what you can do is um, you can sort of use going on down there uh you can sort of use an ender pearl like so and throw it like that and it'll get us out and i've done that a few times but it doesn't put us hey jeb um it, it doesn't put us in the right place that we want you know um it, it could go anywhere you don't know which direction you're facing and all that so uh this should work hopefully uh and i think it's pretty cool uh and you could use this uh guys for just about anything um that you want to travel up quickly and the cool thing too once I find some string is You should be able to put them on top of each other so you can go up a lot higher So if you had to go up, let's say 40 or 50. Where is my string? Um That is really annoying, but if you needed to go up uh, an even further height and uh, You know as long as each I guess platform is uh, less than about 30 blocks you can go you know you can do maybe three times 20 and you can just throw three ender pearls um and you can put dispensers near it oh there we go gosh i that was the first chest i opened and you guys are probably screaming at me sorry guys um really need to organize i know and i, I actually am gonna need some more string soon too uh let's go here and okay so this is a very, very simple. Uh, I know that a lot of times, you know, redstone can get complicated and, and wait, I did not put that in the middle. Wow. That would have, that would have just made me go crazy. Okay. <laughs> Let's, uh, we want this in the middle, obviously guys. And you're, oh man, that would have been just ugly to have it off center like that. Okay. So yeah, we got two on that side, two on that side. Okay. So all we really need to do guys, and you're not going to believe how simple this is, um, but yeah. All right. Well, uh, we're going to put two pistons. So put one right there. And oh, man, that's going to be frustrating. Um, did not. It's not facing the right direction. Oh, my goodness. Um, let's see if we can get that. Oh, I knew that was going to happen. OK, so we got one. Uh, so if I maybe if I back up here like this and place it, let's see. We'll have to go get that other one. And I'm not going to bore you with that when I go down there. So. Um, yeah, so there we go. Well, what we can do, I can show you, hmm, yeah, uh, well, we, we can, uh, we can put it all together minus the one piston and see if it works. Um, let's see if we can get this to sit properly there. Okay. And, um, hopefully we'll, we'll hit this side and, uh, we won't miss this one. We'll take this out for now. Uh, okay. So, oh man, I don't have enough oak wood anyway. All right. So. All we need to do is put um, a piece of oak wood on top of each of these, and it can, obviously can be any block. Um, and then we put trip wires. I think you guys can already tell where this is going, um, but we'll put the trip wire hook here and here, and we'll put one here, although we're not going to be able to connect it just yet. Well, we could. All right, and that that's it. <laughs> that that right there, guys. Believe it or not, is an Ender Pearl elevator. Oh wait, uh, well, almost. Um, we need to we need to put a root a ceiling also. So let me um let me go grab that piston down there, like down there. Uh, well, you guys can see what'll happen. So, uh, uh what'll happen is, um, theoretically, hopefully that this works in my simplistic form, uh, because I don't want to make the bridge look ugly. You you can you can make it a little bit more advanced, but this will um this will make the bridge it'll kind of blend into the bridge. But uh, anyway, you throw the ender pearl up, you'll come through here and boom, this platform will sit here and uh, and then you can walk off. And um, as you guys, well, I was going to say, as you guys can see, I can run across. Oh, yeah, I can. OK, so uh, as you guys can see, run across here. There you go. And uh, we don't have any problems. So let me go get that piston down there and um, let me get a few more blocks so that we can build the ceiling. And that should really do it. Um, Man, that would be nice. Also, I, um, I, yeah, okay, yeah, all right, yeah. Okay, I'll be right back. Oh, crud. Oh, 
Oh boy. Uh, guys, <laughs> I made a mistake. It turns out, I believe, <laughs> oh, that's bad. I believe what happened here is um, one of the vines was on one of these blocks that I broke to place the pistons, which is why you have backups of backups of backups because, whoa. Um, yeah, let me, uh, let me restore the backup and do that again. So, <laughs> oh boy. Yeah, uh, because, oh man, that is, yep, no fun. Be right back. Okay, guys, uh, yep, I was right. It was that block right there that I broke. It broke the vine, which caused a block update um, that, uh, that messed up all my water magic down there. So what I'm going to try and do here is uh, get on stable footing here. All right, that's good. And hopefully I'm going to place a block uh, right underneath and it should hopefully preserve that vine. Let's let's just do it like this and like that. Okay, good. Um, now, jeez. Uh, okay, so now I can I can break that one, but it doesn't seem like I can break the one below it because the second that I break the one below it, it's gonna happen again. What am I gonna do? Ho ho ho! This is bad. Man, um, <laughs> uh, let's think about this logically. Um, let me do some practice in creative mode and figure out what is to be done here on vines. I need to learn vine mechanics, um, and a way to salvage this, uh, because that's, that's, that's an issue. <laughs> I'll be back guys. Okay, guys, I got into a creative world and uh, and put some vines on, let them grow a little bit, not all the way down that far. And uh, <laughs> let's cross our fingers here, but uh, what did happen in the creative world, and could be because I was on creative mode, I didn't switch to survival, and now I regret that. Um, but it does seem, well, you know what, we can test it here. Let's test it on this one first, um, because um, I'm a little nervous to test it on the other one. Uh, so here we go. So, uh, assuming that everything works the same, I should be able to take out, since there are two blocks and it originates from this one up here, if I take out this one below it, it should remain there. Yes! Okay, cool. So it does work like I thought it did. Alright, well, I mean, that I discovered that it did. So, uh, the reverse obviously is true. Let's go and, uh, so where's the center of the bridge? So we're gonna take out, well, I'm gonna take out some X up pieces well mm, just so I can reach that one and not hit the vine so what I want to do is that and then break this one. Oh, this is scary um but okay okay cool so now all right so that should work <laughs> and we shouldn't have to worry about any other um any other clobberings of sorts um this is the center. Okay, so we're going to put this together again. This is so scary, guys. I am sorry to... Oh, boy. Um, But uh, anyway, what I was going to do is I'm going to have to... Uh, before... Ah, no! Ugh. I hate this thing so much. But, oh, let's check it. Let's check it, make sure everything's cool. Okay, everything is cool. All right, good. Um, So uh, what I'm going to... Ugh, I can't wait for this thing. Cannot wait for this thing to work. Oh, will you stop it? Um, nope. Ah, uh, quit it. Just let me up. Okay. Uh, yeah. So, uh, what I will do is, um, and we can do it now. Let's do it now so that we're a hundred percent sure we haven't, um, we haven't ruined this, uh, and that this is possible because, wow. Uh, <laughs> oh, this is not, this is some scary stuff to work with after, uh, after all the work I put into that. Um, so let's go over here. And we'll go, um, oh, they might be down below. I should have some vines up here somewhere, though. Um, God, they're loud. <sighs> wow, that, uh, <laughs> uh, problems, problems, problems. Um, okay, so, I'm gonna look. There, nope, okay, I have, I have some shears, so I could go grab some if there aren't any up here. Assuming I have shears up here. 
There we go. That's what we're looking for. One piece. Well, I'll take them all, but all we need is the one piece. Let's do that. And let's hope that when I place it, it doesn't update the whole vine, but I don't think it will. I think it'll just, uh, we can just put it up above. All right. So we should be able to do that. Come on. Oh, let me get out there. Oh, man, really? I can't place on that, huh? Okay, so um, I'm going to put... All right, so you can't place it on the back of a piston. Hmm, that is interesting. Uh, well, that just means we're going to have to adjust our bridge design slightly um, in that we will just... Um, we'll just have it go at this level, uh, although that should be facing up like that. Um, instead of going up one more. So, you know how it normally goes up one more. We'll just make it go straight across. Let's see if I can get one. Oh, geez. Do not fall down there. Oh, this is bad. This is bad. All right. <laughs> Let's go around this side maybe and we can place it. Ah, no. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> All right. Let's. <laughs> this is so frustrating, this bridge. Um, or this, well... The bridge isn't all that frustrating. It's the, it's this entry and exit thing here. Um, ah, will you quit it? There. Okay. Now, uh, yeah. So, uh, yeah, we'll climb up again. But uh, you guys see what I mean. Uh, in that we're just gonna make it uh, straight across on the bottom like that instead of having it arch up. Not a huge deal. I mean, I'm not a big fan, but uh what are we going to do, right? I mean, we need to make it look um, symmetric, of course, and we need to protect ourselves from that happening. And that's really the only way to do it, uh, other than leaving that block below the piston. Uh, or actually, we have to leave that block below the piston. So, And I don't know why this arrow won't go away. This thing has been here. Maybe you guys have noticed it in my episodes, but it's been here for a couple of months. <laughs> don't know what's going on with that. So let's just double check that we're not going to break anything here. Um... So this one and this one, yeah, we're okay with that. So let's uh, let's break the wood, and let me make sure because if I do the one across, I do the wrong one, we're in trouble. Okay, I can you can see the vine over the edge anyway. So break that one, break that one, and we'll put the pistons down right there and right there. Yes. Okay. So uh, like I was um, initially. Or like I was saying, uh, there we go. So we got that. We've got that. <laughs> Let's get back to this. Uh, we'll, we'll go ahead and put um, these logs on top. We'll take these out of the middle here. Three, four, and we've got tripwire hook. And I do not have string anymore, so I'll go get that. And uh, what I want to do is um, we'll get some fence posts. And, uh, and then we'll use some half slabs. Uh, so let me go make those and uh, get the string and I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. And so we have our string. And we can go ahead and put that there, 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 and there. So let's see. All right. That seemed... I thought it... Did it break the string? It looked like it did. No, it didn't. Okay, good. Um... Not that sure of myself here, so uh, I guess we can, um, we really don't need the roof to be all that tall, but we want to kind of make it, uh, we do need a ceiling for the ender pearl to hit, and I just want to make it look like it sort of fits in the bridge theme, uh, but I don't want to make it too tall because then we're not going to be able to reach it, um, and, but we need it tall enough that our heads will fit under it, blah, 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 you guys get the point. Um, let's try like this. And then, um, we'll go up, maybe? So, let's do this for now. Let's see, yeah, alright, and we'll go up a level. Can I do that? Nope, just do it like that. There we go. So, that's not terrible. Uh, like I said, it will clut- it is clut- it's going- Oh my gosh, did I just do something bad? No, okay. I, I I broke that and then I heard I think it was a, a sheep um a sheep uh eat something and it sounded like a breaking vine. So okay, let's take a look and see how that that's not terrible. That's not terrible. Uh but like I said, the roof is necessary and uh that really is I mean, you know, it's not it's not that bad. Let's see if we can run across it. 
So here we go. No problem. Gives us a little bit of a, you know, a little nudge, but... And breaks our sprint, but... There we go. If I hold down, if I keep tapping G, which is my sprint key, uh, it, it, it's okay. It does seem to be okay. Let's go over here, and um, I want to I wanna get these all facing the correct direction, so that one, and um, <laughs> well, we'll just, uh, we'll just, ooh, that might not be the right place to do that. Uh, well, I'll get to that one later. Um, but yeah, that's just going to have to stay like that. There's not much I can do because I don't think it will grow over the, uh, the piston there. So we'll just leave it on that level. Um, and I'll fix the other side to match. But let's let, let's test this thing out. Um, that's what you guys are waiting for anyway. Um, okay, that's it. All right, good. And yes, oh good. <laughs> we didn't break anything down here. That's, that's, that's the key. Um, so let me... Oh, why do I have no armor on? Um, geez, I didn't even, uh, didn't even realize that. Uh, <laughs> I must have taken it off. I don't really know why I would have, where did I even, why did I, oh, I took it off for the intro. Oh boy. Uh, <laughs> well, um, I, it's, I, it's in my treehouse cause that's where I was when I came out of the nether. Um, all right, well, we can do this without, uh, without armor. So three, two, one. Wait, oops. Three, two, one. Oh no, it's too far. Okay, it's too far. <sighs> okay, let's let's cross our fingers that this is high enough. So yeah, this should this should totally make it. Let's see. Three, two, one. Ah! Oh no. <laughs> um. Hmm. <laughs> let's try. That should totally work. What what's going on here? If it, oh, man. Maybe my design is flawed, but uh, let's try that one more time. Oh, I missed. Ugh. Okay, hold on. I'm a bad shot with Ender Pearls, guys. As you guys could see there, I totally. All right, so that is dead center. Let's do that like that. Yep, that should do it. Come on. No. Uh. Hmm. Let me. I'm wondering if the roof is too... No, it shouldn't be too low. Um, wondering... I'm just wondering. I don't know what's the issue. It should trigger those immediately. Um, well, let me go get my armor on. I don't like being without armor. And then, uh, and then I'll look at my design and I'll be right back. Oh, it worked. Oh, 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 guys. Chicken zombie, chicken, uh, the baby chicken zombie. Where'd he go? Oh, I just saw him. Oh, there he is, there he is. Look, look, look. That's my first one. Haha, <laughs> what's up, buddy? Good thing I have armor on. Um, Look at him. Oh, he's only going to care about the villagers. He doesn't care about me. Look at him. Oh, 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 I got a name tag. <gasps> let's call, what are we going to call him? All right, so let's capture this guy. Come on, come here. I need, I need, hey, hey come here, come here, come here, come here. Come here. All right, let's, oh man. Oh. <laughs> All right, let's block him in. Uh. Got him, got him, got him, got him. Ah, ha, ha. I got him, I got him. Ah, okay. So we're gonna do two, two, two things, guys. First things first, uh, we're gonna make sure that he doesn't despawn. Uh, so we'll name him. What shall we call him? Um, mm, let's think. Uh, he's, he's a mean baby zombie on a ch chicken. Will you get out of here? This has nothing to do with you. Um, Lean baby zombie on a chicken. Um, I, I'm on the spot here. Usually I have time to think of the names. Go away. Oh my gosh. Quit it. Oh no. Oh no. The sun's coming up. Okay. Um, 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 uh, we need to put a ceiling over him or something like so. Yeah. I hope this, I hope this works. Please don't get burned. Um, okay. On the spot, on the spot. 
Okay, so wait a minute. They're called walkers in Walking Dead. Oh, I have a great name. Okay, 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 okay. So, all right, here we go. Um, oh, oh, geez. Name tags, you have to... All right, we'll just do that and that. And we'll close them in there. We have to go name the name tag. So, uh... <laughs> Sorry guys, uh, well, it did work for a second. Um, I think what I may have to do is raise the roof. I just put my hands in the air, that is <laughs> pathetic. But anyway, raise the roof. Um, uh, but uh, we'll, we'll name him first. And I, 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 oh man, this is awesome. Okay, I just thought of it. Okay, so guys, uh, in The Walking Dead or whatever, they call them walkers, right? <laughs> and I don't know if you guys are old enough to know one of the shows on TV that used to be called Walker, Texas Ranger, uh, which was by the actor Chuck Norris. <laughs> so we're going to call him Chuck Norris because he's our first zombie walker that we've ever named. So um, let's uh, let's go ahead and name him so he doesn't despawn. And uh, yeah, so here we go. Let's uh, try not to kill him. Okay, there he is. Chuck Norris! <laughs> All right, Walker, Texas Ranger. He's stuck in there. I don't know what we're going to do with him. We're definitely going to keep him on display because uh, we caught our first chicken jockey. Now, um, uh, I don't know if you guys... Yeah, I probably will cut to the point right where it worked, but I think we should raise the roof a little. Um, I think one more level. I don't... I hope it doesn't make it so we can't reach. Uh, what? Else? Oh, you know what? We won't change all of the other stuff first. We'll just raise the middle part. Um, so I want to, even, you know what, I wonder, can we, if we just, no, we are, we'll do a full block because otherwise it might look weird because it'll be all flat. So, uh, yeah, we'll do that and we can just test it without, uh, holy cow, relax. Um, oh, okay. Uh, we need that. I just want the upper part though. Yeah, there we go. And that, and that, and that. Okay, I'll go. Oh, I get it. It was the uh, the stuff falling on the tripwire. Okay, there. So uh, let's try that. So we'll go down, see if this works. All right, pick all that stuff up. And uh, of course, it's not going to work from here. So I mean, it's not it's it's not that big of a deal for me to have to go here to do it. So, um, and I think what this is going to do, hopefully, theoretically, is give it um give it more time. Up. Oh, well. Hmm. Well, that kind of works. Uh, we might need to go a little higher even because I'm stuck here. Uh, hmm. <laughs> All right. Come on. Let me out. Uh, it does not like this. Uh, hmm. I don't want to break anything, but I might. I might. Okay. Yep. <laughs> uh, let's try that again. I'm not really sure why it glitches like that exactly we might have to go one more block up but ah uh -huh. um but i don't think i don't know if it'll make it this might not actually work guys okay so all right so it's hitting the ceiling uh let me put it up uh maybe another half of a block and when we'll see uh give it another chance well you know what while i'm down here too uh before we go might as well well not that i'm not going to come down here again but i'm thinking about it Oh, I keep getting disoriented and scared. Uh, let's go and uh, enchant this sword again because I get another chance. Because, whoa, hello, buddy. All right, we, all right, we've got a little, got a little group here. Uh, why am I in here? I don't really know. Um, I forgot that I don't, I don't need to go in there. I just need to go here. Do that. There we go. Yes, because we got our levels back. Because I had to reset it. All right, let's try that again. And put it here. Come on, looting! <laughs> oh, wow, I got a way worse sword than before. <gasps> Holy cow, I thought the last one was bad. I should... Ugh, oh, boy, that's terrible. All right. Um. So, yeah, uh, like I said, guys, I'll be... Um. Let me raise that another level. And uh, I'll be right back. I'm going to go up this way. It's just easier. Out of the way. Please, 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 please. Just stop hurting me. Stop hurting me. All right, be back. All right, so bring it up another level. Uh, it didn't quite work out because what happened was, um, and you know what? Maybe I need to make sure I'm in the center. I'm going straight up. Uh, but what happened was uh, the uh, 
but it was too long of a delay and the pistons opened back up. So uh, let's try it here. I put it back down to the original level and I made sure there was string across the middle. Man, it, oh, why does it, that is pretty annoying. Um, oh, I, I've got string at my head level now. Um, that's not making any difference. Uh, maybe that's the strategy is to put it at my head level so that I'm not glitching out the floor, but then, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, let's try that. I'll put these up a level higher, which is going to ruin my bridge design, but looks like it's going to be necessary uh, for this to work without glitching. Uh, yeah, because otherwise, yeah, that might make more sense. Then I can put the roof up a little. Do I need to put it higher? I don't know. We'll see. Uh, but yeah, let me let me put this at at head level instead. Be right back, guys. Okay, guys, I had to do a great deal of, well, reorganizing it. I turned out getting this simple one. Um, not sure how I'm going to make it look nice because redstone torches don't really match, but we'll figure that out later. <laughs> look at that guy. Uh, and there's the arrows. Um, but anyway, this go right across, no problem. And uh, it uses trap doors instead of the pistons. And the trap doors um, don't cause the glitch. I think that pistons maybe take a little bit longer to activate just slightly enough that uh that i glitch through them but i've tried this four times in a row it worked every single time so it should work um the reason that it didn't work and also there's a link in the description to um an overview he didn't do a tutorial but did an overview of this design um and i feel like i should give him credit because uh it actually works in 1.7 and i was gonna <laughs> Uh, I'm, I don't know if I'm going to include that part, but, um, I may, because I'm, I was talking about, it. I was going to move it over to here and uh, I got to thinking about it and I, I thought I, I went back to over here, uh, and realized that I was way more than 31 blocks away from the ceiling and I couldn't figure out why it would ever have triggered. And it turns out that, um, and uh, I, I read about it afterward, but uh, in 1.7, they changed the way ender pearls work and they hit string, as you guys just saw there. Um, it used to go through string and now it hits it. So that's what I was hitting. I was hitting the string. And then when I would hit the string, I wouldn't be up high enough to catch the piston as it pushed the blocks underneath me. For some reason though, Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Let's do this weather off. Okay. Um, for some reason, though, it actually does tend to, or it does seem to work with the, um, w when I when I hit the string and the trap door closes. So all you, look at this guy, <laughs> he's crazy. All you have to do is aim right in the middle and make sure that, uh oh, well, that's not going to work. <laughs> I, I, uh, I missed a little bit there. Let me try that one more time, guys. I got to get better with my ender pearl throws, but because they do arc. So if I start here and I throw it like that, it's going to arc right in the middle. No, I missed again. Okay, so I did get it four times in a row. I swear to you I did, but uh, what's happening is I'm missing my uh, my mark there, and I'm not a very good shot. Did I get it? Yes. And uh, Oh, that, that's because I was I was holding the space bar because, of, um, because I wanted to float in the water. But as you guys saw, it worked there. Let's try it one more time. Let's see if I can get two in a row just so I don't look... So terrible with my poor ender pearl throwing skills. Let's get into the middle. Here we go. And yeah, oh, not gonna throw a string, so we'll just throw our ender pearl straight up. Boom. So it works. Love it. We can go across our bridge. A little noisy, but uh, I can deal with that. Um, I'm gonna need some trap doors back for these things. I used them there, but uh, uh, we'll try and figure out a way to sort of maybe I don't know use some fence posts and integrate this a little bit better but now we finally have a way out of there um uh, i mean a quicker way out of there gosh i'm so afraid i want to like jump over it but i know i don't have to uh and yeah so <laughs> a lot of stuff in this episode i want to check and see if this guy's still here i'm a little uh, you know this was uh, this is a good find i hear him i don't even need to i don't even know i hear him i hear him so chuck norris is in there we've got our ender pearl elevator everyone is happy <laughs> Oh, I don't like those those torches. If you guys have any suggestions on what I should do to sort of, uh, 
I mean, I have to use ev all the redstone in here, the redstone torches and the redstone along the bottom here have to be used in this manner. We can't block any of it. So uh, if you guys can think of a good way to sort of disguise it, make it look a little bit better, let me know. I'm very curious to hear what you guys have to say. So if you enjoyed this episode, please go ahead and give it a like. Also, if this is the first time you're watching my channel, go ahead and subscribe. I play Minecraft every single day. I'll see you guys again soon. Thanks for watching. And of course, noodle on.